Welcome to Atlanta. It's the fifth race of season eight, and 40 cars ready and set to take on this race. And here's the entry list for today's race. 40 accounts are also ready. And here's the starting line for Group A. You got William Byron, Kevin Harvick, Kyle Larson, Daniel Suarez, Row 1, Justin Haley, Austin Sindrick, Michael McDowell, Ty Dillon, Row 2, and Corey LaJoy and Kaz Grolin, Row 3. Looks like Larson with the lead here. Oh, he gets turned by Suarez, but he's going to keep the lead as the rest of the field slides. And Kyle Larson will lead lap one. So Daniel Suarez second, McDowell third, and Ty Dillon moves into fourth. Two laps to go. Here comes Larson. He has the lead again. This time he stays out of trouble, and he will edge out Daniel Suarez. To lead this lap is Ty Dillon and Austin Sindrick both flip over and crash. They will both DNF. Stay replay of this. There you see Ty Dillon and Sindrick. They both slide into the wall and kind of do the exact same thing as they just barely tip over. Enough to go all the way over and DNF. So tough break for them, but we have eight cars left with one lap to go in Group A. So Kyle Larson has the lead over Daniel Suarez, Harvick third, and Haley into fourth. It's going to be really close here. They're four wide. At the line, Daniel Suarez edges out Kyle Larson to win Group A. Kevin Harvick third as William Byron DNFs on the final lap. So Suarez edges out Larson to get that valuable playoff point. And here's the starting line of Group B. You got Denny Hamlin, Chase Elliott, Ross Chastain, Eric Jones, Row 1, Ryan Priest, Austin Dillon, Alex Bowman, Noah Gregson, Row 2, and Jimmy Johnson and Austin Hill in Row 3. Looks like Chastain at the lead here. He's going to slide into the wall. And it's going to slow that car down. And Chase Elliott leads left. One is here. Three wide for second. And it looks like Austin Dillon gets second. Chastain third. And Hamlin remains in fourth. Two laps to go. Looks like Dillon with the lead this time. He's going to slide across the line. And Austin Dillon leads this lap as Denny Hamlin goes up and over. He will be out of the race. He just goes in the wall all by himself. Contact from Alex Bowman and Noah Gregson sends him flying up and over. Does a full flip back on his tires, but that car is too damaged to continue. So Austin Dillon now has the lead with one lap to go in Group B. But Chastain's going to take it away. Oh, he puts Dillon in the wall hard into the wall, and Ross Chastain will win Group B as Jimmy Johnson and Austin Hill DNF on the final lap. And Noah Gregson gets the final advanced spot just behind Austin Dillon. And here's the starting line for Group D. You got Kyle Busch, Joey Logano, Christopher Bell, Chase Briscoe, Row 1, Ricky Stenhouse, Eric Amarola, Brad Kozlowski, Todd Gilliland, Row 2, and Cody Ware and A.J. Allmendinger in Row 3. Looks like Logano's going to have to slightly lead here. Bell's trying to take it away. They go hard into the wall. Joey Logano leads his lap. Uh, Kyle Busch second as Almondinger in the back. Goes up and over. He will DNF along with uh, Gilliland. There you see Almondinger. Just one of the most smoothest flips you'll see. Tough break for him. So eight cars remain. Logano leads. Two laps to go. Christopher Bell's trying to take it away again. And at the line, they go hard into the wall. Christopher Bell takes the lead away. Moving Logano back to second. So we have one lap to go in Group C. Can Christopher Bell keep the lead from Logano? Looks like Bell's going to have it right now. Oh, Logano will go hard into the wall. He's upside down with Eric Amarola. And Christopher Bell will win Group C. What a huge crash. We'll take a replay of this. So Logano looks like he, they just both go hard into the wall. They fly through the air. Oh, my goodness. Logano crosses the line in second, so he'll finish in second. Can't say the same for Almirola, Briscoe, and Senhouse as they three, or them three DNF. 
So Brad Kozlowski gets the final transfer spot behind Logano and Bell. Bell wins Group C. And here's the starting lineup for Group D. You got Ty Gibbs, Ryan Blaney, Martin Truex, Tyler Reddick, Row 1. Harrison Burton, Bubba Wallace, Chris Buescher, Kurt Busch, Row 2. And BJ McLeod and JJ Yaley in Row 3. Looks like Truex has the lead here. Oh, he gets turned into the wall. Truex goes up and over. What a huge crash. Tough break for Truex. Had a really strong car. Not a good day for JGR, except for Bell, who won this group. But it looks like there, Tyler Reddick has taken the lead away. We have two laps to go in Group D. Nine cars remain. Looks like Blaney's going to take it away from Reddick. It's going to be a drag race to the line. Tyler Reddick comes back and edges out Ryan Blaney to lead lap two. And can Yaley get to the line? Yes, he can. So we still have nine cars left with one lap to go in Group D. Can Tyler Reddick hold off the field for one more lap? He has the lead again. He's going to get turned hard into the wall. Tyler Reddick slides across the line to win Group D. And what a three-wide pass on the bottom for Ty Gibbs to advance. So only one DNF in this group, and it's Truex. Just a really tough break for him. And here's the starting line for round two. You got Christopher Bell, Daniel Suarez, Ross Chastain, Tyler Reddick, row one. Joey Logano, Kyle Larson, Austin Hill, and Ryan Blaney, row two. And Brad Kozlowski, Kevin Harvick, Noel Gregson, and Ty Gibbs in row three. Chastain at the lead here. He's going to slide into the wall. He goes hard into the wall. So does Tyler Reddick. Tyler Reddick flips up and over. He'll DNF out of the race, along with Kislowski, Gregson, Gibbs, and Harvick. So five DNFs on lap one. I see Reddick gets squeezed into the wall. That just creates a traffic jam. Clogs the whole track. And makes five cars DNF. So seven cars remain with four laps to go. Track house, one, two. Chastain with the lead again. And he's going to slide into the wall. Oh, Chastain's up in the air. He's up and over. He will DNF along with Austin Dillon. So more than half the field is DNF'd, and we're only two laps into round two. See, Chastain flies over his teammate hard into the wall. Flips that one car right up and over. It's probably the best car this season to not win a race yet. So only five cars remain. Suarez leads. And it's going to be really close at the line. Daniel Suarez edges out Joey Logano to lead this lap. So we have two laps to go. Five cars still remain. Suarez, Logano, Blaney, Larson, and Bell. It looks like Logano has the lead here. Blaney's trying to take it away. He goes in the wall. Daniel Suarez through the middle keeps the lead. As Blaney just barely gets to the line. So we have one lap to go at Atlanta. Suarez leads over Logano. Larson third, Bell fourth, Blaney fifth. They're four wide. Who's going to have it? Oh, Logano goes hard into the wall. Daniel Suarez slides across the line in front of Larson to win at Atlanta. As Logano goes up and over on the final lap. Suarez puts Logano in the wall. That's what you have to do to win one of these races. But Logano will finish P5, so really not much of a loss for him. So congrats to Daniel Suarez on his first win of the season. And also congrats to Upper Groove Racing. Uh, he goes, or he gets his second win of the season. And here's the results from Atlanta. And here's the car points. Top four are now locked in on wins. And here's the account points. Look at the points lead Mr. Awesome has. This might be the biggest points lead in ramp racing history. 